12 p.m. game, 12 p.m. Eastern time on the ACC Network, Miami. The Hurricanes go to Pittsburgh, both teams coming off of major wins last week. Miami, of course, beat NC State by one point. Pitt beat Clemson by 10 at home. And uh, Miami is headed to Heinz Field. Pitt, a nine and a half point favorite, total of 61. Odds brought to you by BetUS, where the game begins. Go ahead and click the link in the description. Make sure you get signed up and use that promo code that's down there. Miami won this game 31 to 19 last year. They are five and one straight up and against the spread in the last six. Miami seven and one straight up, their last eight at Pitt. Uh, however, Pitt this season playing completely different. They are seven and one against the spread in their last eight games. And you look at their numbers and Chris, as a, like, just power rating, Pitt is a top 10 team right now. Uh, this line opened at 11. It has dropped down to 9.5. My number on this was actually Pitt minus 12. I, you know, but I looked at it, and I was like, man, Miami's been playing a whole lot better here lately. I, I really wanted to go Miami here because Tyler Van Dyke has been good, but this Pitt defense has been playing insanely well. Pitt has figured out how to run the football and Kenny Pickett is like a jack of all trades, man. Like, not only can he throw the football, but this guy can run anything that you need him to. He's in like year th- what year three or four with the offensive coordinator Mark Whipple. And when you've got experienced guys like this that understand how to run basically everything, you don't have to just stick with the stuff that you're good at. You can be good at everything. So I I think I'm I'm going to change my pick right now, and I'm actually going to go with Pitt minus nine and a half here. I might feel like an idiot. On, on Saturday morning because Miami has been playing better, but I think Pitt is just the overall, I mean, just significantly better football team. What uh, what are your thoughts on it? Yeah, I'm with you. I, I like Pitt. I like Pitt minus the nine and a half. I don't, I'm not, I don't think Miami is what we saw last week. I just, I just don't. I mean, they, so they, they played two within three of North Carolina, but they also gave up like 45 points to North Carolina. Last week, some NC State, you know, mistakes actually maybe cost them that game. Uh, otherwise, Miami would be, you know, but they have played close games since uh, since Tyler Van Dyke took over. So I am kind of curious about that. Uh, but I, I do think that Pitt is significantly better. I did not say this beforehand. Meant to our records uh, last week. I went six and six. Chris went three and nine. I am sitting at forty one and forty three on the season. Chris is thirty three and fifty one. Uh, you can find the picks over on the website. Uh, just click on where it says picks. Very easy. It's winningcureseverything.com slash picks. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.